something different here. What up, YouTube, YouTube? You guys remember that? The whole custom girl 420 dude back in the day? What up, YouTube, YouTube? Anyways, um, so I blew up my motor on my Street Triple RS. <laughs> which we're going to get into a little bit, but a little walk around this 2007 Honda CBR 600 Double R. Bringing the backpack out today. She's been dying to ride. You know, women, of course. Women. Right. Little tailpipe exhaust action. This thing, believe it or not, 2008 original miles, original motor. It's only got 4,700 miles on this thing. So, one of my followers, Milo, on Instagram, uh, hooked me up for the day. Well, actually, the weekend to take this bad boy out so we're gonna go up good old trusty Azusa Canyon you know one of the most dangerous canyons in the world but just kidding not the world but it's fun it'll be a nice chill day we're squidding as you can see I bet, honestly, on a super sport, I can elbow drag here. Yum. Ricardo yeah. and Sebastian. Yeah. Battle. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, so, so great. <laughs> So it's Memorial Day weekend, so this road is going to be uh, pretty busy, if uh, my memory serves me correct. Um, but, on a side note, so we're on this beautiful CVR 600. Thank you Milo for uh, hooking me up with the bike for the weekend. And uh, why, the question is, why do I have this bike right now? Hey kids, it's story time! <laughs> well, let's just say we did a oopsie whoopsie fucky wucky uh, on my Triumph Street Triple RS which decided to pretty much go kaboom on me. Um, I've been having a few issues probably since almost like January of this year now and it's been a lot of coolant issues so for those of you unaware Triumph is known to have not overheating issues but really coolant issues it usually stems from the radiator cap from the factory or thermostat so within the span of two months my bike was in and out of the shop thank you buddy my bike was in and out of the shop uh, for both of those things actually so first time it went in was a bad radiator cap and uh, second time it went in was for a bad thermostat got the bike back everything seemed to be working just fine uh, I did one track day on it and then one canyon run and it started literally pissing coolant out of the overflow which to me only made sense of a couple things it was either one a blown head gasket or two some sort of air bubble in the coolant system so I went and got the uh, coolant system flushed made sure that the there's no air bubbles in it or anything like that um, and everything was fine ran you know for like probably thank you buddy uh, for probably half a day no issues then the next day I go for a ride and it just started squirrel squirrel it just started pissing out coolant again 
So at this point, I'm just kind of pissed and I got no idea what's going on. So I take it to my handy dandy Triumph dealer and uh, they had no idea what the hell was going on with it either. So they're like fully taking the motor apart. They take the whole top end off. Come to find out, it's a blown head gasket and the head warped. So what do they have to do? They gotta hit up Triumph UK. They gotta get everything dialed in and serviced and replaced that needs to get replaced. And uh, they quoted the Triumph UK like $13,000 to, to just fix the top end. And uh, Triumph pretty much said, nope, not gonna do that. So now at this point, I was just gonna lemon law it. So I called uh, Triumph headquarters and I'm like, look, I have this bike here. I'm having these issues. I've had it in the shop now like probably 60 days over the last, I don't know, three months. And uh, it's just, uh, it's very frustrating, right? So they finally, they're like, okay, we're just gonna send you a whole new motor. So now they're fully, they, uh, it's still on the assembly line. They're assembling the motor as we speak. Hopefully get it finished by the end of the week. And uh, well, have a brand new motor with zero miles on it by the end of June. Uh, so yeah, that's that story of Mr. Triumph Street Triple RS. Sent her a little too fucking hard, mate. <laughs>